Hey guys, how you doing? Hope you're doing okay. We're going to have a look through two articles in regards to the same subject, which is a missing person report. The lady that you see in the picture in front of you, she's been missing as of April the 15th. She went on a date, seemingly. She met somebody through the dating app OkCupid, and uh, she has not been seen since. And uh, seemingly she has not used her phone since April the 15th. Her name is Leslie Ben Lusso, I believe is the pronunciation. She's gone missing from Sacramento, California. Um, so she had planned to meet up with someone on a dating app, OkCupid. Okay Cupid, okay uh, and that's the last we know of her. Um the family are extremely concerned. They say that she has no mental health issues. Uh, Sacramento police have said that Leslie left her home on her own accord and there is no evidence of foul play, but uh, her family are extremely concerned. April the 15th was close to three weeks ago now. Um, she had her birthday this past Sunday, so two weeks give or take after she went missing uh, if anyone has any information obviously contact the appropriate authorities the police in sacramento california and if you are in the area please do promote this uh issue uh, as much as you can if you're a member of any facebook groups or such please do get the word out there feel free to refer to this video uh, or any of the articles mentioned here so we're going to have a look at a second article here which shows us a little bit more pictures uh, which were caught on cctv uh, so it says here haunting images show a california woman heading on an ok cupid date she never returned from with her frantic her family frantic with worry two weeks on leslie ben lasso who turned 42 um, the Saturday after she vanished was said to have been picked up on the morning of April the 15th, but then disappeared without trace. Uh, there is security footage from Orchard Thai Restaurant and Bar in Sacramento, uh, which was taken on April the 15th. She was then seen walking up 16th Street towards the University of Beer Bar. Um, the person Leslie was supposedly meeting up with from the online dating site went by the name of B. B. Bia. She was last seen wearing ripped jeans, a t-shirt, a unique brown leather backpack. There we go. And she was meeting somebody called B or Bia via the dating app OkCupid. Okay so she has a number of tattoos all over both arms by the look of it. There are these pictures uh, caught on CCTV uh, the day of her going missing. There's uh, her sister. Her family are very scared. This is not like uh, Leslie to go missing. And uh, the family say that she has no mental health issues. Um, so they are desperate to hear back. Again, of course, if anyone has any information to contact the authorities, that would be the police in Sacramento. And uh, we hope, we pray for her safe return. Um, she might well be safe. We hope that she is. But then, of course, something sinister may have occurred, which is why the family and the police need to have some reassurance that um, she is she is OK and that she will be able to return home safely. So I'm going to wrap things up here again. If you are in the area of Sacramento, please do what you can to uh, promote this subject this uh, missing persons report uh you know refer to the articles uh refer to this video whatever's best uh, but in the meantime we're going to pray for the family and for leslie 
but she does uh, return safely. I'm going to wrap things up at this point. If you do value this type of content, please do like, comment, subscribe, share the video as you see fit. Check out some of the other videos and take care, guys. Take care. Look, we're not about to demonize dating apps. We're not about to do that. We're still human. We still need to meet with people. Uh, we still need to introduce ourselves to strangers. Um, it seems like Leslie perhaps did the right things in a lot of ways. She met with uh, her date in a public area in front of CCTV, and that's a sensible thing to do. Um, but, of course, we we all have concerns. She hasn't used her phone since the day that she went missing. Um so we just need to know what's going on there. But uh, yeah, look, carry on using these dating apps. Carry on meeting other people. But of course, do what you can to be safe. And maybe use a chaperone. I know it's extremely old-fashioned to have a chaperone. But maybe that's the thing to do. Have a chaperone, you know. Maybe they can announce themselves to the date. And then just go to another part of the restaurant and... You know, just be there in case something happens. Um, but anyway, I'll wrap things up here. Take care, guys, of yourselves and your loved ones. Thank you.